my connection with the ocean has always been strong. I've been lucky enough to live by the coast all my life. My love for surfing reinforced this connection, both spiritually and environmentally. My name is Claire and I am a South African living in Malta. I grew up next to the oceans in South Africa and currently living on the beautiful Maltese islands in the Mediterranean Sea. In autumn of 2021, I was surfing with some friends at our local spot called Riviera Bay. We noticed a sea turtle that was literally drowning in plastic and nets. We managed to get her onto my surfboard and paddled her into shore where we contacted our local wildlife rescue Nature Trust Malta and they took over from there. This led me on my journey with the turtles here in Malta. I just couldn't get the turtle out of my mind. She was barely hanging on. I contacted Vince Attard, the president of Nature Trust Malta, and became involved with the rehabilitation of these turtles. The biggest problems these turtles face are being caught in lines and nets, which often result in amputation of their flippers, ingestion of hooks and lines and plastic, and their shells being cracked open by boat propellers or other heavy debris that's floating in the sea. My hope for the future is that environmental cleanups will become normalized in our businesses, our schools, and in everyone's day-to-day -day lives. We are the problem, and I truly believe that only we are the solution. But probably the storm last night washed it up. After a few months of rehabilitation, Riviera was given the all clear by the vet, Dr. Propeta, to be released back into the wild. We released her at Golden Bay Beach. And this was such a beautiful and emotional day, watching her leaving the shore. However, one part of me did wonder if she would meet the same fate in our polluted seas. But hopefully she will continue her life swimming freely and safely. <laughs>